the visual aspects of candlestick analysis are the primary reasons why trend reversals can be identified so quickly. Note as the uh, Dow pulled back and got close to the 50-day uh, moving average, we did an inverted hammer, a potential reversal signal. Friday, it did a doji right on the 50-day uh, moving average, giving time for the stochastics to get down in toward the uh, oversold area. Monday morning, started trading positive, which was a good indication that after a doji occurring right on the 50-day moving average with stochastics toward the oversold area, this was the time to be covering short positions and adding to your long positions. Also, we could all add as many indicators as we can to indicate that there's a reversal. If you look to see, there's a trend channel, and this was occurring at the bottom of the trend channel. If this market moves back up, it could move all the way back up to the top of the trend channel, meaning over the next few weeks, if we get bullish confirmation tomorrow, we could have a, a good two or three week uh, steady uptrend until the top of the trend channel is reached. The same scenario can be used on the short side, where if you'd been short STX to the time that it gapped down into an oversold condition, which tells us immediately we want to start looking for a buy signal. The gap down right on the 200-day moving average after a steady downtrend with stochastics in the oversold area is a very good place to start taking profits. As we can see, the buying started right on the support level, creating a belt hold type signal with further confirmation today. Simple rules in candlestick analysis allow you to get out of uh, profitable trades at the optimal time. Where do most people sell? They panic sell at the bottom. That's where you want to start covering your short positions. Positive trades like AFFY coming out of this slow rounding bottom and breaking out to the upside and then doing a 45 degree. These are all indications that can be pretty well established as far as common practice of investor sentiment based upon certain conditions of the market. Nice rounding bottom breakout, no pullback reversal, but a 45 degree probably in the same uh, trajectory as the trend uh, was prior to that. Knowing these simple rules helps a candlestick investor make quite a bit of money depending on the conditions of the market. That'll be it. We'll see you in the chat room.